Today we are going to answer all the commonly asked questions about gynecomastia, also called as male boobs or moobs. I'm Dr. Karishma Kagod, board certified plastic surgeon, practicing in Bangalore for more than 12 years. We are a Dr. Karishma Aesthetics and today I'm going to clarify all you need to know about gynecomastia. What is gynecomastia? Gynecomastia is a condition which is characterized by an enlargement of a male breast tissue. It is an abnormal enlargement of the male breast tissue, sometimes combined with excess fat also. The experts say that more than 50 to 60 percent of men have gynecomastia and sometimes it goes unnoticed. You can have this condition anytime starting from puberty in and up to 60 to 65 years plus and can be treated at any age group. Gynecomastia is a condition can cause a lot of distress amongst many men. They can be socially disturbed and can develop anxiety and depressions. But you need to diagnose your gynecomastia after a proper medical evaluation by your plastic surgeon. Definitely all men look for a certain way with which the gynecomastia can just disappear and I wish there was a way that it can disappear and not come back again. If you have developed gynecomastia, first and foremost, you need to get it diagnosed and make sure it's not just excess fat, but it's the breast gland tissue. And most men may confuse the two and that is why we have two terminologies. One is pseudogynecomastia and one is true gynecomastia. You have a pseudogynecomastia and you may think you have enlarged breasts or chest, but that could be just excess fat. Now, if you are on the heavier weight, high BMI, and or you have recently gained a lot of excess weight, sometimes it just could be fat accumulation underneath the chest, and that is what we call pseudogynecomastia. How do you differentiate and know that it's actually true gynecomastia? You must start the weight loss process, start exercising, do chest workouts, and try to lose as much weight. While you are on the process of weight loss, you will notice that some part of the chest is shrinking. And that is what we notice, and that is what the fat component of the area is going down. At the end of the fat reduction, you still notice that there is this firm lump underneath the nipple region. And this firm lump is actually the true gynecomastia. So once you've lost weight, if you feel the chest have become absolutely flat, then possibly it was just excess fat and not a true gynecomastia. However, after weight loss, if you still see a firm lump and some puffiness under the nipple, definitely it is an enlarged gland tissue and it is a true gynecomastia which needs to be treated medically. Gynecomastia or male boobs can be noticed at a young age of even 14 to 15 during puberty because of the spurt of hormones and because of the excess spurt of hormones during the puberty, the boys notice that the gland tissue is enlarging under nipple and nipple. They commonly uh, notice that the nipples start to get puffy, there is a swelling. Sometimes the nipple or the chest looks conical in shape and looks very abnormal. For young boys at the age of 14 to 15, it is difficult to do the surgery, so we advise them to wait till they're at least 17 to 18 years of age. In the meantime, we advise them to get into sport activities, get into fitness, try to lose the little baby fat if they have. And many times we see that the chest gets much better because of the weight loss, even the excess fat in the chest tends to resolve over a period of time. While they're 17, 18 and they're joining college, of course, the boys are really conscious and uh, you know they don't want to wear tight fitting clothes, any tight t-shirts look awkward, the nipples may be pointing out, looking puffy, they may get socially embarrassed and you know sometimes they get teased by their friends and peers. In that case you can offer a gynecomastia surgery at the age of 17 to 18 uh, with the consent of your parents or your adults or your legal guardians. Well, uh, gynecomastia can be treated not just at the young age of 17, 18. It can be treated even if you're 50 plus or 60 plus. Up to the age of 70 to 75, you can treat gynecomastia. So it is a treatable condition. Gynecomastia is seen in adults, not only in children. Some men notice it later during adulthood. A few boys notice it earlier in life. So anything from 17 to 18 years to above 65 can be treated. If you're at an older age group, you need to be also a little medically fit to undergo the surgery. And it's a very small surgery. So if you're reasonably medically fit, mentally positive and motivated, then there's no age limit for a gynecomastia surgery.